Well, NASCAR fans have their eyes on Iowa and specifically Iowa Speedway in Newton this week. It's the first time that the NASCAR Top Series will be here in Iowa. That's right, and there are four things that people should know before the green flag drops Sunday. Reporter Lindsey Burrell has more. For the first time in Iowa's history, NASCAR is racing into town for the Iowa Corn 350. But before the drivers start their engines in the Hawkeye State, here are four things to look out for this week at the Iowa Speedway. Number one, bragging rights. This is the first time NASCAR has hosted a cup race in the 18 years of the Iowa Speedway. So whoever takes home the trophy Sunday night instantly becomes a part of Iowa Speedway history and the drivers will be battling for first in front of a sold out crowd. I was I was stoked, you know, I was I was happy. We've all been wanting a cup race here for a long time. Number two, the fastest short track. Coined as the fastest short track on the planet, the 7 8 mile oval short track opened back up in 2006 and has 10 degrees of banking in the front stretch with a banking system of 12 to 14 degrees in the track's turns. But there's a catch. The Iowa Speedway had to repave certain parts of the track ahead of the race, which will create a new obstacle for drivers with or without experience at the Iowa Speedway. I'm, I'm a little bit worried now that the pace is going to be really fast and it's going to be uh, harder to pass, um, but the, the speeds are going to be tremendous, that's for sure. Number three, drivers to look out for. Coming off a win at Sonoma and being granted a playoff waiver, Kyle Larson currently leads with 561 points, 675 laps led, and seven stage wins. But it was Brad Keselowski who passed Kyle Busch back in 2009 with only eight laps remaining to win the inaugural Xfinity race at the Iowa Speedway. Hug the bottom. Right now, Lowski with a second win and an inaugural win at Iowa. It was good. You know, it was hard for me to reconcile the fact I hadn't been here in almost eight years. Um, but, you know, you, when you get here, you know, it's just... Uh, like putting on an old shirt, you know, you know how it feels and where to be. Keslowski currently ranks seventh, but he's looking for an inaugural repeat. Number four, infield of dreams. Is this heaven close? It's the Iowa Speedway. And as far as the eye can see, the Speedway is surrounded by Iowa's crown jewel corn. Iowa leads the nation as the largest producer of corn and cup drivers will get well acquainted with the crop as the winners will be handed fresh ears of Iowa sweet corn. Plus, the race is sponsored by Iowa corn powered by ethanol. It's a weekend full of Iowa first and the green flag drops for the Iowa corn 350 Sunday night.